So Richard Burbage is a UK-based timber manufacturer. The company's changed and evolved massively over 150 years. Really, the longevity is based on being close to our customers. Uh, we used to supply the DIY sector. Why have you moved further away from the DIY sort of market? So the, the, the move really has been done by the consumer themselves. A lot of people have moved away from DIY over the last 10 to 15 years and gone to the done for you market. So we've relied on more of the installers and our link with really good joinery specialists and carpenters to drive our business forward. So what is the process? Someone is at the start of thinking, what do I do to change the first impression of my space? What's the first step? Uh, first step's an inquiry. Um, so go out and do the survey. Um, take photos, take measurements. Go back to um, Richard Burbage and their technical team put together what, what I need during the survey, find out from the customer what system they want, and okay. then go back and then arrange to go and install. Okay. What would you say are the practical benefits of renovating versus starting from scratch? Less disruption. Okay. Cleaner. Halfway through, you might want to change some, some aspect of what your original thought process was. Um, so you've got that flexibility as well. We've managed to track down some of your customers who are here at the show. As you know, it's a very popular event. Where did it start for you? Why did you want to do this project? What did you change in your home? Well, we actually um, decided that we needed our hall stairs and landing um, updating. So the next step was to try and get um, somebody to obviously come out and give us estimates for it and see what they could do. So that's where Rob comes into play. And he came out and uh, talked us through all the different processes. There was three or four different designs which we could have or different systems that we could have. And we came up with the design that we wanted. He went away, got us an estimate, and that's it. <laughs> he came and uh, we had it fitted yeah. in there. So if you, if you don't mind me just flipping it back to Rob very quickly, what Rob makes... Richard Burbage appear at the top of your pile for recommendations? Well, there's a wide range and there's flexibility between the different systems. All their systems have quite a wide flexibility to them. Okay. So you know that it's going to work um, and you can do it for the budget that people are looking for. You, you can actually get um, cheaper products on the market in there. But yeah, at the see. end of the day, the, the quality wasn't there like Burbage in, this, in there. I like DIY myself. I'm, I'm quite keen at doing the DIY in there. But at the end of the day, I, now I've seen the finish on what Rob's done, I could never ever have got the finish that this man's got on as in there. Okay. So. So. And I'm not just saying that because he's there. He's, he done, he done a really, really good job. Okay. So that's, the, that's down to these people as well. Yeah, my daughter says she can't believe how modern we've gone. You know, she looks For how old we are, we've gone modern. <laughs> the, the simplicity of doing a hallway makeover through changing your stair balustrading is really brought to life, I believe, with our network of installers and the premier centres for people to go and view the product, see the quality of it. I, I believe the future for, for us as an organisation is to get closer to these installers to take more products to them for people to realize their vision, their dream for their hallway um, and not have to just put up with poor bog standard product because I, I believe that this is quite an affordable project that we can uh, make people realize their dreams for their hallways. It sounds like that your relationship with uh, independent installers such as Rob is very, very important uh, to the way that the business has gone so far into the way it will continue into the future. Thank you for your time. Uh, I hope you have a, a good first impression of us if it's the first time you've heard of us. Uh, and maybe let's have a round of applause for our panel for coming up here today. Thank you very much.